What brings you to Ireland? A wedding. No, oh, congratulations. Oh no, it's it's not mine. <laughs> it's my friends. I can't believe Paul and Emma are getting married. Oh, oh, oh. You balance me out, Madeline. We do make a great team. We do. Hi, Mom. I can't help but think that things would be different if I had told Paul how I felt. You're gonna have to start speaking up for yourself. It's too late now. I wish I was marrying Paul Kennedy. What the? <gasps> Paul? Emma! Have you seen Paul? I haven't seen him anywhere. <laughs> how did he get in there? What is wrong? I am not the one who's getting married. She is. <gasps> exactly. You, my friend, are marrying Paul Kennedy. Yes! Come on! <laughs> Hello. It's you. How'd you get the ring on your finger? You got down on your knee and you proposed to me. I proposed? I mean, yes, of course, of course. Yes, I proposed. <laughs> My publicist said that we should get some PR pictures in some idyllic Irish backdrops. He thinks it'll help boost my sales figures. Oh, so not just a wedding, but a good PR event too. Yeah, exactly. If you're gonna spend the day with us tomorrow, can you leave your snark at home? I'll do my best. It's like a dream, although I'm not a Hey, you're pretty good. <laughs> I'd love to get married up here. Why don't you? I don't want to be difficult. I'd hardly call having a voice at your own wedding being difficult, would you? Is it everything you imagine? I know this might sound strange, but I'm not sure this is supposed to be my life. the time to speak up.